The graphic descriptions of how Adam Montgomery allegedly treated his daughter Harmony's body after she died. Those details part of opening statements in his murder trial today. Thanks for being with us at 430. I'm Liz Streppa. And I'm Jack Thurston. The defense admitting its client abused Harmony's body after she was dead, telling the jury that Adam should be punished for that crime, but not for murder. Opening statements started with the question, where is Harmony? Prosecutors say everyone was looking for her except her father, Adam, who, according to the state, thought he could get away with killing the little girl if he could just get rid of her body. The prosecutor, describing the stress on the family as they were homeless and living out of a car, and that Harmony was having toileting accidents often, sending Adam into rages. The prosecution described Harmony's slow death in the back seat of the car, moaning and gurgling as Adam ate fast food than the months-long process of moving her little body as it decomposed. You'll hear that she went from this little girl full of life, a girl that radiated happiness, that radiated joy, to a scared girl, broken, bruised. And from there, she went to the dead girl in the duffel bag. And after that, she went to the, she went to the dead girl rotting in the ceiling, the ceiling that the defendant slept under for months. The story presented by the defense is that Kayla Montgomery is the killer and their client, Adam, was simply a loyal husband helping her cover up the crime.